first time I ever performed, it was like, I was very nervous. It wasn't that many people there, it was like an open mic. Like 10 people in the crowd, but it was like I get this feeling. To this day, I still get nervous. And then one person told me, like, it ain't fun if you don't get nervous. When I'm on stage now, I be feeling like God. Like, everybody just be paying attention to me, and they be reciting the words, and it's just like a Michael Jackson moment. <laughs> Story of shooting, woke up like a boss video. I woke up feeling like a boss, yeah. Stuck in some more, waited off. Took a load and took a load and took some more. Now I'm a boss, yeah, yeah, yeah. I woke up feeling like a boss. We shot it in Dominican Republic. We really went over there for my birthday. Like, we just went to, um, you know, go out to just sightseeing, just to see stuff. And we had our cameraman with us, and we were like, we might as well shoot, you know, the video out here. And it was fun, you know, we got to meet new people, see different things. You know, it was like horses walking down the street. And it was just a, a, a different and good experience. My name, YFN Lucci. YFN stands for Young Fly Nigga About Cash. My brother, Trey Pound, um, one of my homeboys, wide fan Trey Pound, he gave me the name. We had made a song, we were actually rapping. And then he was like, he, he called me Lucha in the verse. And then I just ran with him from then. And Lucha, like, basically to us, it meant money. Being in the music industry and being a father, like, you know, you gotta balance it. Like, my kids, they young. Like, um, I have my little girl, she's three. My little boy, he's two. But, like, they understand that I'm a rapper, cause when we be out, they see all the people run up on me, want to speak and want to take pictures, and they listen to my music. And then with the music, you know, you know, you just gotta balance it though. It's, it, it ain't it, it, nothing impossible. Long live Nut. Um, basically, I was paying homage to my big homie Nut. He died right, right after I dropped my first mixtape, Wish Me Well. Basically, he was one of those guys like just believed in me, like, like. Why you harder than everybody? Like, why you the, you the best rapper? You smell me? Like, no, no, no matter who I say it, like if I say Lil Wayne, my favorite rapper, or these people, my favorite rapper, he'll tell me I was better than them folks. So, you know, look where I'm at now. So, you know, I just paying homage to my big homie.